a big problem that people have, and I know I've had over the years, but I've been uh, able to, you know, uh, really get a lot of positive uh, things done in my life since I've done this, is to get out of my own head and to stop thinking that I can't do something when I can, or maybe judge, uh, judging myself um, like I used to all the time and by you know, because most of us are hardwired to be in a uh, constant flow of thoughts and uh, with turning to emotions and feelings. And when we get, um, when we get our, our minds get addicted to these feelings and thoughts and these routines day after day, and it just um, pretty much leaves us in a status quo uh, situation where we're not really. Uh, growing much but we're you know just kind of pretty much using our minds but for the wrong reasons when we're thinking about worrying about what other people are doing or worrying about little things that are going to be okay um, if we think we're crazy or if we think that we're stupid then we're gonna you know we're not gonna accomplish much but when we realize that we are smarter than we think we are and that we can do anything we put our minds to that's when you really can take off in your life. It's pretty incredible when you're able to start slowing down your brain waves and when you're able to stop, when you're able to start being more present in the moment and not worrying about past situations or what's gonna happen an hour from now or two days from now or two months from now. I stay away from the news. That's one thing I do is I stay away from it because these days it's pretty negative. And I, you know, watch a lot of inspiration. That's why I put a lot of inspiration up on the, uh, my channel here. Um, it's so crucial that you realize that um, when you're able to stop and slow down negative wave patterns and thoughts and feelings towards things and people in life, that's when you're going to really grow the most and be able to make those changes in your life that you really want to make. Say if you have you you know New Year resolution, uh, you know passions of uh, you know stopping you know smoking cigarettes you know or you know if you have business ideas and business plans that you have on paper but you haven't been able to take action on it yet, when you're able to start slowing down your brain waves and taking yourself out of that bad place of thinking that you're dumb or you're not good enough and that you can't do something. And you're going to really start to accomplish more in life when you're able to realize this that you are you know you're a smart person and that you just have to learn and uh teach yourself and uh you know change uh old thinking habits and thinking patterns of negative things and negative places and uh the same old routine patterns and worrying about what other people think and analyzing other people um, as soon as I stopped analyzing other people and myself, things changed, okay? It unlocked something in my brain for creativity and especially being more happier in life. Um, there's a lot of negativity in life. There's a lot of negative people out there. But just because someone else is negative doesn't mean we got to be negative. As long as we put out positive vibes, the universe is going to react to it. And um, this is a very powerful thing when you're able to think positive around people and you're able to embrace people not thinking about past situations or judging yourself or other people based on past experiences and decisions your life's going to really grow a lot it's um it, it's just one of those things that our brains have a potential that's you know unlimited in our in our lives we have a potential that's unlimited of what we can do but if we keep wearing the same old shoes every day so to speak Thinking that we're not good enough, you're never going to be good enough. But as soon as you realize that, yes, you are good enough and that you can do whatever you put your mind to, especially when you put it on paper and you start taking action, just small little, you know, bits of action at a time, you know, little set little goals for yourself and in your life and things will uh, start to change for you as soon as you're able to start making a healthy routine pattern of what you want to do in your life and what makes brings you happiness and joy. A lot of people think and feel that happiness really comes with having to have 
uh, money and being in a perfect relationship, which these things are really not true. The truth is that we need to get more happy with ourselves first and to get our own and to uh, be in a good place in our lives before we can embrace and be in a relationship, a serious relationship and find our ultimate happiness. That's why a lot of people stay in relationships that really aren't going to end up going anywhere because people don't want to be alone and they worry about uh, being alone. They worry that other people, they're not good enough when a lot of times you are good enough. And um, when we're able to start getting more in a meditative state of being more aware of our situation and being more grateful for what we have in life, not worrying about what we don't have, that's when it really starts to get very uh, interesting. And uh, that's when really the beauty happens. When you're able to wake up and be grateful for what you have, be grateful for the um, people in your life, be grateful for the stuff you have, the stuff you own, having a roof over your head when you're able to start showing other people love out in public being more um open-minded and uh more um spontaneous you're going to start feeling a lot more better and feeling more a lot more abundant in your current circumstances in life and regardless of your current circumstances in life whether you're uh, trying to recover from addiction um to uh, drugs or alcohol, or you have a mental illness and or PTSD, any of that stuff, which is all stuff I've been diagnosed in the past with, severe depression disorder and severe anxiety disorder and obsessive compulsive disorder, which I don't suffer from these anymore because of practicing mindfulness and being uh, in meditation. And um, when I meditate, it's not in an Indian circle. Like right now, I am consciously here in the moment and that is something that's so big for everyone else out there to learn, to be able to get out of your own head and to stop worrying about what you can't do. Start concentrating on what, on what you can do and not worrying about the negatives in life. And uh, the biggest thing is not to compare ourselves to other people and to not and to stop feeling bad for ourselves. Um, take this the wrong way, but me i know now that every action in my life good or bad that's happened is on me and when i realized that my life grew uh tremendously uh because of my happiness in life and my abundance because i was going through life blaming things look search situations and being mad at people for nothing and making myself more sad in the process so when you're able to start forgiving people forgiving certain situations in life and yourself especially and moving on from there and uh, embracing life life's going to start getting good for you and your life's going to start taking off and you're going to start really enjoying life more um, don't try to miss don't look for that missing link in life thinking that you that you're missing out on someone or you're missing out on something because that's not true okay it's only thing that we're missing out on is loving and enjoying ourselves in this and in this life. And um, I really hope that uh, everyone out there is doing well in these. This video has helped. Um, I'm going to start doing more of them. Um, it's a beautiful day today. Um, looks like spring is coming. It's like, almost like a spring day, but really, like uh, you know, no, there's just no nothing that can stop you from doing what you want in your life your dreams your aspirations everything you want anything you want in life you can make happen you just got to start living it first and start being that person you want to be or become maybe find a role model model yourself after the he or she and start uh, being more positive and loving in life and not negative and, uh, and, and hate, right? When we get hateful or when we get resentful, that makes us more depressed. So when you're able to start feeling more love for people and love for life, life changes for you. And it opens up a lot of doors and it opens up your mind to all the possibilities. 
um, endless possibilities that you can run into and have for yourself in this life. And um, I, uh, so I hope you all have a great day. Please uh, um, subscribe if you can. Um, I appreciate everyone that's been subscribing and watching my videos. Um, I'm still learning this YouTube process. It's a, uh, uh, but uh, embracing it. And um, yeah, hope everyone has a great day. It was a uh, good job.